Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to copy files to a virtual machine in Hyper-V without having to use any kind of a network connection. So normally if you'd want to copy some files you'd have to, you know, share a drive on the VM or on your host computer or use the uh, remote desktop and shared resources on there. So if you just want to simply just copy files to a VM without having to set that up, um, it's pretty simple to do. So, okay, so we have this one VM here, Windows 10 Home, and so you can see on the desktop there's you know nothing really there so what you want to do is you want to go to that virtual machines uh, virtual disk file and mount it to your host computer so so if you don't know where that is you could go to the VM settings and then hard drive and then you could find that path right there you could just copy and paste that path or you know browse to it and so there it is so I have this open right here so one thing you notice is if the virtual machine is running, you won't be able to do it. So if I right click it and pick mount, it says it's in use. So I'm going to have to shut down the VM. Okay, so now that the VM is turned off, let's go back to our VHDX file here for the VM. Right click it and mount. Okay, so now you can see we have the contents of the C drive here. So if we go to, let's say, the uh, users, and this user, and there's the desktop. Let's just do a new text document. And then maybe we could also copy a file over there. Uh, let's see. Okay, so now we're going to restart the virtual machine, but before we do that, we need to unmount this drive here. So we could right click it and pick eject. Okay, and then go back here and restart the VM. Because if you don't unmount that drive, you're going to get an error saying it's the, uh, the virtual hard drives and used by another process, so it won't be able, you won't be able to start the VM. Okay, so we're logged in, so you can see there's the new text document that I made, and then the file that I copied over from my host computer's hard drive over here. So, yeah, pretty simple. So, like I said, um, just make sure the virtual machine is off. Find your virtual disk file. If you don't know where it is, you could get it from the settings. Simple thing you could do here is just copy this and you know, don't don't copy the uh, VHDX part of it, but then you can you can just uh, paste that into your Windows Explorer and there it is. Right click on it and choose Mount and then copy your files over and then make sure you right click on, on the drive itself when it makes the drive letter for it and eject it before you restart the VM and you should be good to go. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.